red snappers that I want to talk about is when you put them together, it's I do machine installations and when you go to install a machine and put these together for a person, well there's three of these tubes that have to be joined with a lag screw. Okay, so three tubes per liter, so that ends up being uh, six lag screws, yeah, that have to be done. And, you know, you start the lag screw on one end of the red snapper, start it in the other, and a person can do this to, to join that together, but when you've got six uh, brand, brand new ones to put in, I'll tell you what, even after one, your forearms start to throb. Now, if I'm not an installer and I could do one a day and in six days I'd have it done, I, that'd be all right, I guess. But what you can do is take them like this, get it started just a little bit, and then take the red snapper and do this. It's kind of getting a crank shape to it, like an like a old crank on a Model T or a farm tractor, and just turn it like that, and they'll screw right together. Woohoo! <laughs> and you save all that wear and tear on your forearms and the hard work twisting them together. 